Good morning, everybody. This is Wednesday. Moment of destiny. Pastor Adibo coming your way this morning. Oh, will you start by giving thanks to God for his mercy? Start by appreciating him and blessing him. Oh, wherever you are, thank him. Thank him that you are seeing uh, more or less half of this month is literally past because God has been faithful to you. Ah, that's why songwriters say, all my life you have been faithful. All my life you have been so good. Somebody join me, let's appreciate the Lord. Let's thank him. Let's bless the Lord. Let's appreciate him for his keeping us over the night. Thank him that you woke up this morning. Oh, from the time you, you, you wake up till you lay your head. Ah, we must sing of the goodness of God. Appreciate him. Father, we thank you. We do not take for granted what you are doing in our life. We thank you. You are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful. We receive all our praise, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Amen. Uh, we've been talking about um, the, the ten levels of the wisdom of the wisdom that God gave to Daniel. And we, 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 we were praying from Daniel chapter 5. Verse 11, he said, there's a man in your kingdom in whom is the spirit of the holy gods. <laughs> in the days of your father, light, number one, was found understanding and wisdom like the wisdom of the gods were found in him. So the first level of the spirit, the first level of wisdom that God gave him was light. The second level God gave him was understanding. Second level of understanding of, of wisdom is understanding. You cannot walk in wisdom when you lack understanding. Understanding is how to apply. Knowledge is what you know. Uh, 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 understanding is what you see. And you see, the Bible says understanding, uh, wisdom rests in the heart of him that has understanding. So the, in this morning, we're going to be praying for understanding. The psalmist say, Lord, give me understanding, I will live. Uh, let's begin to pray for understanding. Wherever you are right now, you need God to give you understanding of the situation that you are facing. Psalm 32, uh, verse uh, 9. Psalm 32, verse 9. The Bible says uh, here in this verse, Psalm 32, verse 9. The Bible says that uh, you need understanding regarding the situation you are facing from the Lord. Do you not be like a horse or like a moon with no understanding, which must be harassed with a beat and or else they will not come near. You need understanding. Uh, Lord, give me understanding that you don't have to be like a horse that has to be pushed or that will be beaten. Lack of understanding is uh, the reason why people are not outstanding in their, in their journey of life. You want to ask God to give you understanding. Because when you have understanding, your approach to life will be different. When you say, Lord, deliver me from misunderstanding. To understand. Uh, understanding uh, is what delivered Daniel from death. God gave him understanding of the, of the dream of the king. And that was what delivered him from being killed with the rest of the people. So understanding will help you to escape. We're going to be saying, Lord, give me understanding of your ways. So that to know what is happening around me. Lord, give me understanding that will make this year understanding journey for me. It is one you want to pray for. That Bible says that. Proverbs 4 verse 7 say he said wisdom is a principal thing and he said with all your getting get understanding anyone that get understanding always get wisdom they work together that is why I want to uh, I want us to pray and say Lord the second level of wisdom that I need to operate in Lord give it to me today give me wisdom give me understanding According to your word, it's a wisdom is principal thing. Get understanding with all you're getting. Get understanding. If you embrace, I will promote you. Lord, the understanding. 
of the work I am doing that will promote me. Lord, give it to me. Understanding will bring honor. If we just embrace our understanding, will bring grace. Lord, we pray for your understanding. Understanding of this year. Understanding of today. Understanding of your will. Understanding of what you want me to do today, Lord. To be able to advance what I need to do for this year to produce for me. Understanding of how to help my children. Understanding how to keep my marriage. Understanding on how to how to stay healthy. Understanding how to overcome the challenges I am facing. Understanding from you, Lord. Give me understanding and not let me remain under. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Whatever you are, if you are there, you are not born again. Take this prayer after me, Lord Jesus. I come to you right now. Forgive me my sins. Wash me with your blood today. I receive you as my Lord and Savior. Thank you for saving my soul. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Please help us share this broker with other people. As you are listening to it, remember understanding is what enhances undertaking. Even if to praise God, you need to deal with understanding. When you have understanding about something, it enhances your ability to undertake. Understanding enhances enhance undertaking. You will know how to undertake your things for this year if you understand so please i want to let me share this with other people at least about 10 people share with them because we are praying for 10 levels of wisdom so please let me share this with other people thank you very much tonight we are going to be having a program by uh, 8 p.m on recovery tv that is on youtube and on um, recovery community services facebook page and adibo on your facebook page by 8 p.m uk time which is 3 p.m washington dc time join us for another t- time of wisdom that will enhance your destiny and move forward to the next level god has ordained for you in jesus name god bless you bye-bye